All right, let's take a look at the first one. This one's a nice little Pythagorean relationship. They tell us that that's 9, which makes this 9 diagonals bisect each other. It tells me that this is 15, and they want me to find this. Well, this immediately lends itself to a nice right triangle Pythagorean relationship that would say x squared plus 15 squared equals 18 squared. And from the looks of it, at least by this notation, we expect decimals in this uh, problem. All right, let's, um, let's take a look now at uh, a couple of other things here, this last problem. This last problem tells us that EAD, that's this guy, is 63 and then this would also be 63 base angles of an isosceles have to be equal now you say how do I know it's an isosceles well um, um, a rectangle has congruent diagonals and they bisect each other and then the last thing is they tell us what AED is which is the vertex angle they tell me that it's 4x plus 8 so we'd have two 63 angles those would be our two base angles our vertex angle is 4x plus 8 angle 1 2 and 3 and they equal 180 and again what allowed me to do that was my knowledge that this guy indeed was an isosceles and I know it's an isosceles because the diagonals bisect each other and are congruent